Uh, I'm, yeah, oh, it steers. Okay, it's kind of like a horse, but way less stable. My first creation ever. It works so good. Looks like we've got a lot of things to break. Give me this, give me this, and this. It's so sad that there's no living creatures around yet. Oh, this thing looks alive. Do you like hammers? I love hammers. One circuit board from whatever that thing was. I need to find somewhere to start building something. And I also need to figure out what it is I'm building. I think we're getting close. It's just like Hydranir all over again. But instead of washing gold, we're pouring water on electronics. To be fair, given that this was my ship, it probably set itself on fire. It was tired of living with my stuff. And with that, the fire is mostly put out in the ship, at least to a serviceable degree. Now we can actually explore what we have. Requires power? Of course it does. Requires master battery. Uh-huh. So that's how you put batteries into holes. Wait, so where is this supposed to happen? I don't know why nothing's working. We poured lots of water on it. Gas can. Never mind, it's not nearly as exciting as you might think. All right, we'll uh, find something else to play with. I did pick up some seeds while I was smashing everything, so we'll probably plant these close to the water because watering. Ooh, can we plant them in the water? I feel like that probably isn't going to grow anything. Is that just a bag lying on the ground? Or spilled? Uh-huh. That's how you do it. Oh, I got to smash it open. Hmm. Kind of regret that in hindsight. Game, I need another bag of soil. I'm not really sure what happened to my last one, but I definitely need another one. Oh, never mind. I can actually... Yep, we can just go ahead and plant and eat. Oh, I got my food and water gauge. Oh, that filled up both, whatever that was. I'll say this, a watering bucket is a nice refreshing change from a watering can. I've used a watering can far too many times in my gaming career. That water looks pretty good. We've got more food, but do I want to plant and water more stuff? I don't think I'm going to need it because I'm going to be more of a pillaging type of farmer. So let's go find the neighbors. I've gone 10 feet and already I'm finding lots of things to play with. I was eyeballing that structure. There's also a castle. This is just stone. This stone is too big for the sledgehammer. That means we can get bigger tools and I'm very excited about it. Oh yeah, get over here. You and me need to have a talk. Set up a 4K, get back here. I want to smash your brain in. And we're good. All right, what kind of treasure did we get? Do we have a choice to refine things or pick them up? I'm going to pick them up for now because I'm not sure if refining them does anything. What is this? Okay, I either have to carry them around or I refine them into something else. My sledgehammer doesn't break the stone, but I can use a potato peeler to kill a metal arm. Whittle it down into I don't know what. Uh, I'm being attacked. Scrap metal block. Do you mind? I'm trying to investigate your insides. They'll all get their turn. They just got to be patient. Guess it won't be hard to find my ship. Though that thing over there is smoking as well. Do we have any other smoke in there? Ooh, this looks fun. Hi there. I'm new to the neighborhood. Was just stopping by to take your stuff. Component kit. And we got more of these metal arms. I guess I'm just going to refine them for now until someone in the comments tells me why I shouldn't be doing this. I don't know what this is, but I want to make my home in it. Oh, it breaks. Well, now I don't want to make my home in it. The only question now, how do we get up there? Do you think we can make that? And just about, I might be able to do it here. So is there an auto jump feature or is this a bug? Because this is pretty annoying. It appears to be a bug. There is in fact no button for just automatic jumping. So we'll kind of try and bunny hop like this. Wait, nope. Does this game have auto save? Wait, oh, it's working. We're going to get up there. I, I don't want to quit right now and lose my progress. I haven't gone very far, but I still don't want to do it again. And jump. Okay, we're hopping our way back and going to bed and trying to save. Tomorrow, we'll figure out what it is we're going to build. Maybe just heavier shoes so I stop jumping everywhere. This is really annoying. Is he okay? Is he asleep? Is he dying? Is he hopping? I'm not really sure what's happening right now. Apparently, that's how we use our bed, though. So, great. Enjoy your night. I guess I'll just exit out and hope it saves. Well, we're not jumping anymore. We are stuck in the wall, however. I could probably use the bed as a middle point. Please get out to the right side. No, we're still jumping. Our character is permanently jumping. I fixed the problem. Turns out it wasn't a game. It was my keyboard because I break everything I have. So it turns out for my stuff to actually grow, I probably need to fertilize it as it says by this step here. It feels really counterintuitive that left click is not pick stuff up. I just obliterated the only fertilizer I had. So I'm going to need to find more of that. I've just learned I can mine the entire forest. Yes, it's called mining now. Trees turn into these. These could be the start of a new creation, or we can refine them down into something else. They turn into wooden blocks. So far, I know I can build stairs, probably as high as I want, so I just need to find something worth getting on top of. For now, I'll follow the trail of breakables. This place comes with its own stairs. A bearing. Interesting. Another bucket that we probably don't need. We have a spare bucket here. Hi, do you have any fertilizer? I would really love some. Lots of these things are giving me carrots though, so I don't think I'm going to run out of food or water for a while. What is this? Use... Oh, it's a chest. 
Got it. I'm gonna be refining things like this as I go because I assume that scrap metal has gotta be used for something. I think I found the battery I need. Yep, sure did. I think this is one of those games that rewards you for getting to places you're not supposed to get to. The top of the tower had one beet and one carrot. And looks like nothing else but at least a nice view. That's where I started. That's where I'm probably going to go. Not sure how big this world is, but if you look out there to the sides now, it's pretty big. A little faster, please. I don't have all day. So there we go. Do we have power to the whole thing now? Did I do it right? Looks like... Wait, can I pick that up? Oh, that's actually an item. Okay, we'll put those there and then we're going to use this new thing. Craft bot. This is telling me all the different things I think I need to do to build a vehicle. I could almost build an engine already. I just need a little more wood, but I don't know if I want to build a vehicle yet. I haven't explored that far out into the world. Speaking of which, let's go find some new stuff. Even the flowers or something. There's another one of those things charging at me. There's the ocean. We'll go explore the ocean because oceans are fun. Oh, never mind. He's just forking a cow. I want to fork the cow. Stop touching my creature. That thing actually almost killed me. Now, what are you exactly? Right. I'm gonna smash you in the face now. Can I take the parts from this now? Oh. Okay, bye. Sorry about that. I'll find you later. We have determined that there are cows on this island. I didn't really think there was anything underwater, but it looks like there is. Like these. Blue clam. Oh, that sounds like it could be useful for something. I found another cow and some beehives and some giant corn. I'm hoping this is a source of food oh it is okay well i'll leave this here for now because i don't want to destroy all of it because this might be my only food source for a while because i don't have any fertilizer these on the other hand we don't need those well can you at least drop this stuff on the ground beeswax cool so we've got lots of different items to find we just need to figure out what to turn them into back on my ship for now i'm gonna make an engine just to see what happens need a little bit more wood got it and we gotta wait and it's done one engine which just looks kind of like that okay well that can hang out there for now. I'll go find the rest of the parts needed for a vehicle, which is actually mostly just wood at this point. I gotta go where I find some wood, which is perfect because it's nighttime anyway, so you guys won't be able to see. After a sensual night of refining wood, I've got this. One engine, one car seat, which I assume attaches to the engine, three soon to be four tires, Now I just need to figure out how to put it together. I'm thinking I built it all on this little thing, and then I can remove this thing, something like that. I just need to build like a frame or a body for my vehicle. But I'll probably also need a connect tool. I'm gonna build one of those right now. I also have a microwave apparently. Let's microwave, I don't know, this? Just a chest. That's less exciting. So this is what I need to connect things together. I guess kind of like a welder. Let's try it with a few boxes. I'm going to see if I can put a few boxes together, put some wheels on that, attach those to an engine. So that. And then do I use this now? Does this not work on this thing? I don't think it works on boxes. Maybe we can get away with doing something stupider though. I found the guide on how to do this. It's just going to take a little more parts than what I have. And using just basic wood is probably a better idea anyway. Naturally, I'm going to use minimal room for everything. Engine directly behind the seat where it couldn't be more dangerous. It even lets me adjust the power all the way to max. Looks like it's probably also going to be a lot of bearings. But that's alright, we can make as many as we need. Still need a few more bearings, but I think I'm getting the hang of this. It'll look something like that. So this is what my vehicle looks like now. I just gotta figure out a way to make the power go to where it's supposed to go. I think I'm doing this right. So the orange should be the power, so it's gonna drive those wheels. The green should be the steering. And now it won't start. I think it probably needs some of the fuel. Uh, can we just... There we go. That might have done it. Now will it start? Wait, What? Oh, I'm dehydrated. Good thing I've got tomatoes to eat. That should take care of it for now. Game, I'm busy building stuff. Here we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Uh, I'm, yeah, oh, it steers. Okay, it's kind of like a horse, but way less stable. My first creation ever. It works so good. I'm glad it's dark out so no one can really see this. But now I understand how the game works. Uh, yeah, that was worth my time to build for sure. The plants don't need fertilizer. Wish I'd have known that sooner. I would have been planting a lot more things. Or like 10 because I'm too lazy to water more. Unauthorized farming detected. Yeah, because clearly someone owns this land. I do hear an angry sounding robot. And I see lights. Oh, okay. Oh, it's just these guys. Hey, don't touch that. It's kind of a trade-off. They're bringing me parts I need anyway. So yeah, bring your friends. Bring the whole family. I think they got one of my tomatoes. But you know what? It's a tomato and I'm okay with that. Oh good, there's more. You're welcome. And it's finally morning again, so let's try our vehicle one more time. And we're off. Well, it's got 
No shortage of power, probably could have made it a little less narrow though. And robots are once again attacking my farm, apparently. And that's kind of annoying, so I'm mostly just gonna ignore my farm for now. They can have it. I'm seeing a lot of robots over here by this factory, so that means there's gotta be something good. Hmm, they can detect me from a long ways away. Probably not really good at climbing things though. Well, they're not bad, but they're not that smart. Probably somewhat less smart than me. I could probably just build my way up into here without having to deal with them. Hopefully I do get these blocks back at some point because they're kind of hard to get the metal ones. I gotta kill those guys to get them. But for now I can make stepping stones. As long as I can make the jump. Whoops. There we go. Let's figure out what's in this big chest. Oh, never mind. We can probably just go in this way anyway. This will be so much easier. They probably can't run faster than me anyway. Turns out there's actually a staircase that goes up anyways. So I just wasted a bunch of blocks. But this place definitely has some good stuff. We got some fuel and we got some scrap metal. And whatever's in this. Please don't fall the wrong way. You fell the wrong way. So far, finding a lot of farming stuff. I feel like farming is going to be a core theme in this. That is a big tree. Really want to cut that down. They even have roads for me to drive on. If I can never make a vehicle that doesn't tip over right away. They're not going to put a tree this big in the game and not have something fun to play with. You would think maybe I've got to get to the top of it. It is a very nice looking game though, isn't it? Right now, I'm going to go and build a better vehicle. One that's a little bit less tippy. Then we can use that vehicle to maybe explore a little bit further. Because I can only walk so fast. Did you didn't know there was a third person view? Neither did I. I don't know how I did this. Alright, so basically the tires just need to be a little bit wider out. It's too tall and too narrow. This design, obviously, is going to be much more stable. Alright, well let's see if this works any better. Whoa, it's a little bit too powerful. The steering is a little bit sloppy, but it does, hasn't tipped over yet. Never mind. Maybe let's turn the power down a little bit, because if it's going to flip over backwards, it's not really to my benefit. And, okay, this is a little better. It's not great and it kind of gallops, but it moves. Why is this steering backwards? Oh, the steering's backwards because I set it up backwards. There we go. The sky's the limit now. Look how fast we'll be able to travel around everywhere. I kind of want something that flies instead. Flying would be so much easier. Not really sure yet what the point of building this was. But we have a vehicle. Starting to think that front wheel drive might have been a smarter option. Same result as before. All right, we need better parts before we can have a reliable vehicle. That can wait right there. I jumped into the water to get away from him. But then I noticed that. What do you think that is out there? Turns out it's some sort of building. Probably was supposed to take a boat here, but we made it. Not a lot to find so far except for an angry robot. There are more islands out there that definitely need exploring. I really hope there's a helicopter at the top of all these stairs. Well, there's at least two of those guys. I'll wait for them because those are going to do a lot of damage. Never mind. Seems this should be the end of the line, but not for me. Because I'm just going to build my way across. You can build bridges wherever you want in this game. And I like that. Whoopsie doopsie. Don't fall down. Now, I'm not sure there's anything to find up here. Wait, there's at least one little chest. Which has... That thing in it, component kit, that seems like it's probably fairly rare or something. I don't really know. Now we're getting somewhere. There is two of these plus a big chest. Off-road suspension. You have my attention. That was an orange item. Interesting. I didn't know I could find things like that. And the big chest has whatever this stuff is. I do like the way you don't necessarily have to absolutely craft everything. You can find some of the good stuff too. More islands. That's where I came from. Another island over there with a big tree. And I can't help but wonder if there's something up there. It's not looking like it, but I did find my way to a very high location. I definitely need ideas for what I can build in this game because I feel like there's going to be a lot. 